what's up, what's up, what's up? What's up, guys? You're great, Ariana, that cute little brown girl. Everybody want a little taste up and welcome to day of Vlogmas. I can tell you right now, my breath is on fire. It's on fire. I didn't brush my teeth yet. I was on live the other day and they said, Eri, you know, do like a get ready with me. And I'm like, okay. So, how are y'all feeling today? Let's go ahead and start getting ready because we're on a time frame. It is now 10.58. I'm giving myself until 11.30 to be ready. So, for brushing my teeth, I use Colgate Optic White. I got my TheraBreath, you know what I'm saying? Got to have that. And because I have braces and it's so hard, I got this Oral-B. I had to get some new ones. It's a super floss, kind of goes in. Um, sometimes I use my water picker, but I actually didn't charge it and it's out. So we're gonna have to do it the old fashioned way today. So what do y'all do first? Do y'all wet your toothbrush or do y'all put the toothpaste right on? I wet mine first, but do y'all wet it again? Do y'all wet y'all toothbrush again? So we're gonna go ahead. I wet mine again because I I just like, yeah, I don't know any scientific facts about it. I've seen some TikToks and stuff about people saying, you know, don't rinse your mouth out after you brush your teeth. Just uh, spit it out until all of the stuff is out. And I got to talk to my actual dentist about that. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, y'all, so I had to take a little break from brushing my teeth because I needed y'all to hear this part of this podcast that I've been listening to. I've been on a podcast vibe lately. I've just been trying to make sure that everything that I watch, everything that I'm filling my ears with, everything that I'm spending my time with is literally adding on to me versus me taking away time. I cannot get my time back, but this knowledge, this information, these different perspectives start giving me these thoughts. They start provoking different um, solutions. They start, you you know just getting my brain tools turning and we love a good thing like that so I've been looking on TikTok I've been looking up um just certain people who I know that I look at to be successful or even people that I just think have a really good mindset hey do you listen to podcasts hey do you read books and really going into looking to the book looking to the writer and things like that and I challenge you guys as well to just take an hour a day 30 minutes a day five minutes a day and just add on to it however you think that is best for you to start don't look at it as forcing yourself look at it as something that you just genuinely want to do if you're like yo I want to go to work today you're going to go to work with the attitude is like, I don't want to go I hate this job I this I that now you're just speaking all these negatives into the world and now you're going to be in it and it's like everything just going to keep adding on so again start your day with prayer allow God to lead you to the right things the right people to ask these things really just allow like you know but I'm about to show you this part that literally stuck out to me I had to rewind it and play it and then I'm going to finish the routine okay. it's actually one of the greatest gifts you can give them. see potential somebody is one of the greatest gifts Challenges that you have to be with them for who they are, not who they could be. Oh. Unless, unless you're willing to be patient and willing to be wrong. If you're willing to be patient and that's the part i heard you know what i'm saying accept people who they are you know accept me for who i am but you have to be okay if you're wrong you have to be okay if you're wrong we be thinking like oh yeah he gonna get together oh yeah she gonna get it together if she this is any other but who, who what if that is not who they are you have to be okay you have to be patient and you have to be okay if you're wrong and that's why we always make a mistake of falling in love with somebody's potential and like he said unless you're okay with being patient and being wrong so that was just a gem I had to drop for y'all. Here the gem. Bam! There y'all go. Um, we gonna go ahead and finish this routine. Uh, uh. that they're saying this is where I want to live. This is who I am. Now, sometimes people under your mentorship may even for a short period of time believe they can. I had this happen recently with a couple that I was coaching. Where? Okay, time step is eleven thirteen. Dang, I'm taking a long time than I thought. Okay, okay, that's cool, that's cool, that's cool. So I'm about to wash my face. So we got CeraVe Hydrated Facial Cleanser from normal to, from normal to, oh, for normal to dry skin. I'm like, what? This is my sister Nayla. She left it here. I'm going to use it because I want to see if I like it. So we just gonna take a little bit to see. But I also be using Cetaphil Moisturizing Cream. Sometimes if I'm being honest, y'all, I just use water and I wipe my face. Today we're gonna do a little different because I am breaking out because of some other stuff I put on my face. First and foremost, because I use my hands, I don't have like a face applicator. We're gonna wash our hands. Make sure y'all keep y'all keep going until you see some suds now. If you about to put your hands on your face. Now, some people would say, no, nah, I don't do that. 
but it works for me. Hold up, wait a minute. Get up in there, boy. So what do y'all use to wash your face or what do y'all suggest is a good facial cleanser for me? My face doesn't really break out, but um, when I did get the case of chicken pox, in my 20s which was like very sad you know what i'm saying you guys were there for that process that was a very sad moment for me in, in general i couldn't believe myself that i was this old freaking chicken pox but anyway this bad boy feel good okay i like this is it supposed to be like this or is it supposed to be like blathered up oh mm, yeah like i feel like i just oh yeah I don't think I'm gonna do no makeup today. I really feel like my face needs a break. I did, um, Nayla did wash my makeup brushes and stuff, but I really don't think I should like do no makeup today. I really wanna do like more of a of a natural face because I just like to make sure I, making sure Ari know you look good. I'm gonna go ahead in with my moisturizer. Damn, this bad boy is thick, baby. Ding, 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 ding. So um, with that being done, I don't know what I'm wearing today, but we're gonna get into that a little bit later. Right now, it's time for a shower. Y'all ready to get this good shower in? Let's go ahead and scrub it up, dub, get in that tub. Make sure you wash in between and don't forget them chins. I know you're rushing. I know you got places to go. But you better make sure you wash everything from head to toe. I know you're ready. Uh, don't forget to moisturize. And you better not rinse your body till you see suns on the other side. Woo! Love y'all. Stay tuned. Y'all, I'm, I'm beat. Y'all see my face glistening? That's that moisturizer. You feel me? So I'm sitting here. I'm fresh out the shower and a part of my get ready with me is a sad attribute of mine is get ready and procrastinate. But my plans for today is when we link up with the boys, I know what videos I want to do already. So that means that if we go in, knock them out, we don't lollygag, we don't talk, we get them done. I can get home, get Daniel home, got some spaghetti. So eat some spaghetti, maybe warm up some other, like something I can warm up. I'm using Vaseline, y'all, because I went so long as a little kid and in my adult years as well, not putting on lotion. It's completely unhealthy. I understand it, but... Now that I'm older and I'm trying to take more care of my skin, Vaseline it is, y'all see that? Y'all see that? So you just rub that bad boy in, you know what I'm saying? Get on in the arms and the crooks and the crannies, you know? Don't be shy. A lot of times people be like, oh, I'm trying to save this girl. This costs $4, your skin being dry, that ain't right. That man touch your hand, your friends touch your hand, anybody, and they like, there go alligator Aerie. Absolutely not. Luckily, I didn't get made fun of, and I knew how to mask it really well, you know what I'm saying? Obviously, if you're gonna see this body part, I'm gonna have some lotion on. But don't nobody wanna be in gym class, take off their shorts, and your stomach is as white as snow, you feel me? After I moisturize, I go in with, I'm running a little low with my oil because it sticks a little longer with the actual um, Vaseline on top. So putting your oil, this one right here is number 27 which is Beyonce's heat type and um Akeem's body oil we're dressed we're dressed we're dressed we're dressed we're dressed so I am wearing a two-piece set top and bottom from the shoe bar sim diva shoe bar so make sure i go check that out i just wanted something really chill and simple comfy at the same time i'm about to call my sister anela so she can show me how to take this out of my head I see this now? <laughs> so look you see this piece right here i couldn't i couldn't i had wrapped my hair already and i had a piece left now i didn't want to make no tiny bit too nice so i had curl d you know what i'm saying I do that all the time. I'm gonna be using this to take my hair down. Just yeah, Cause y'all, if y'all follow the Nayla channel, y'all will know this is her expertise. This is her area. For me, I would've put this bad boy in a ponytail. Okay, give it a little. Y'all, my hair supposed to be completely dry when I take these out. I forgot I haven't been back to now since I was back in high school. Never again. Yeah. <laughs> all right, now I do what? Do I need more oil? You should be fine. If you feel like your, your hands still got oil, yeah, they look they look ashy. I mean, uh, you just leaving it in the phone. Yeah. Good, good. They look moisturized. They do, don't they? All right, now what I do? 
It's all right. But when you unravel, you be careful. Like, you have to be kind of patient. So start at the bottom and just unravel. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, you literally just gonna twist it. And when you get, like, caught on the part, like, carefully take it out, because that's how you- So untwist it and then what? Just untwist it. Untwist it and then you're supposed to separate them. But untwist, you have to untwist all. Oh, start at the bottom. Okay. Dang, people do this every day. Mm -hmm. Shout out to all the natural girls out there. Oh, no, no, no. They do it every, like, once a week. Once. And what is it, what, yeah, but what is it good for? Huh? What is it good for? Just a protective style. Just easy to, I don't know, it's cute. You, you put it in bands or not, you can leave them in or take them out. I mean, it just makes your clothes look cute. Mm -hmm. That's it. Nothing for real. Oh, my goodness. I look like a little kid. It just needs to be on top. How I unfuck it with my hand? A brush? Remember, no. You're gonna brush out all the work you did. No, remember I said, but well, that's what the oil for is too. So you, put, you probably need to put some more oil when you unravel the hand. But when you separate the pieces, you gently separate them and twirl them in the direction the curl is. If that makes sense? How I know which way the curl going? So let me see. I got a piece of my hand. So you see how my is curl right here. Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna twist it in the direction it's curl. So I'm gonna separate and twirl. You see how it's twirling? You see how it is? Mm -hmm. So you're gonna separate gently and then twirl. That makes sense. Curls look good already. Come closer. Ah, especially that front one. Ah, that look is pristine. Yeah, stop it. Stop it. Cut it out. Cut it out. Cut it out. I feel like you were in the 18, 1800s when it was uh, serving dinner. Mm -hmm. All you need is an 1800 dress. <laughs> now, I, if I sing it for me. Five, six, seven. I ain't never been with that yet. Sing it out. I just didn't tell you. <laughs> okay, oh, I don't want to do the rest. <laughs> what do I do? So I take this. More oil in your hand. More oil. Now take it and what? Now separate it. And twirl it in the direction the, the curl is. I don't even know which way this curl going. Yeah, you twirl it the right way. So keep separating it. Dang, should I clip these up or something? How does look? This the unravel part. Yeah, yeah, keep unraveling. Oh, the curls look really good. You don't have to keep unraveling. Oh, cause I got so much hair and it's stupid. It's not stupid. You just do got a lot of hair. Now this is one side, one section. You, cause you moving like a turtle, girl. Cause you told me to be careful. Oh, well, yeah, you you, you gonna be rough if you move fast. Now that's because I, this is what you enjoy doing. Either. I usually, I'm a twist out type girl. What's a twist out? You just twist your hair. You twist, one, you do twist. And make sure you twirl it in the right direction, babe. I am. Okay. I think, feel right. What's gonna happen if I twirl in the wrong way? It's just gonna unravel, like, it's just gonna make the curl go the opposite way. Oh, oh my goodness, something up here is twisted in. Wow, I never even knew you should put oil on your finger. I thought, like, if anything, wash your hands. Oh, jeez Louise. Oh, man. Come here. It looks good. You gotta fluff it out. How do I do so, that? In your roots. I wish you had a pick. Do you, have, you don't have a pick? Uh -uh. Just do. Come, come here again. Do you see parts like look at your roots and see if there's still like hair at the roots that needs to be separated? Like you can still separate some like on the um, on my left. You fluff it out with your fingers at your roots. The curls look really good though. They came out defined. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> Shout out to Nyla. Shout out to Harry. You did the work, sister. <laughs> you had the product. 
<laughs> it would have been looking different. It would have been water and me. You <laughs> said what? It would have been me and water. <laughs> All right, y'all, so this is how my hair looking. I'm gonna fluff it out some more, but I hope y'all enjoyed this get ready with me. We gonna go ahead and make us some breakfast and things like that and get on the road to go. I don't know what time it is, but I feel like I'm running late, running on time, but who gonna say something to me? I am because I'm trying to stick to a schedule. But I love y'all. I wouldn't be here without y'all. Like, comment, subscribe, turn on post notifications, hit that thumbs up button, comment down below. Team Mary all day, every day. If you didn't know, now you know, no, 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 no. Oh, here the up close to the girls. Y'all see that? Do you see that buoyancy? We're gonna play with it some more and unravel some more, but I don't know, I kinda wanna put this in a ponytail. Guess what? You gotta fluff it out, boo. Alright.